it is fun, it is competitive, and most important, it works. 12 o'clock, 2 o'clock, 12 o'clock, 10 o'clock, repeat. Hit pan and foul to start. We. 12. 10. The idea is that we want to create instincts. We want we want to um, we want to be able to practice many many different turns, left and right feet, turning in different directions, so that eventually it becomes instinct. Now, jongens, we gaan werken met soccer matrix. 12. Daar begin je met inspelen. 12, 10, 2, 4. 8, 6, goed, goed, goed. Hou vol, hou vol, hou vol, hou vol. Each time they go into the unit, they set a high score. So whoever gets the high score gets the green jersey. And then at the end of the session, we do several rounds of this. At the end of each round, we will collect the high scores, and then them, them players will go into a grand final. And then we will end up with one winner from the session. But as I say, we, we try and make it fun, but we can also make it very competitive. So um, when you see a green jersey, that means you're doing well. Just jump around if your body can move. We we teach this as early as possible. It should accelerate other development, which in effect should create more, a lot more, better players. Jump around if your body can groove. Let them really come, okay? Oh, good, sir. Not on one foot, stay stand. Don't stay in the field, don't we can work with as four units, as many as 32 kids, and we can have them, them kids get in, in, in one hour in the region of eight, 900 touches each. So they're not just any touches, we actually know what turns that we want them to do, what feet that, that they, they use and which way they turn. So there are lots of touches, but they're specific. 12, 10, 5. If you want to learn a technique, you have to repeat it. It gives you a score, it's fun, and you don't mind repeating. And that is, is known, that's the only way that you will learn something.